Hello everyone and welcome back to Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor, where we last left off. We helped down helped a dwarven friend to hunt a uh, great white grog. And now we've got a few things left to do. Um, mostly collectibles. Well, the collectibles and other stuff, like main story missions. Um, I want to do this though. So I'm gonna go over there. Also, it's raining. <laughs> bye bye. Stop fighting, Ranger. Oh, you've got some information, do you? Anything about someone I don't know. Bulk the beggar. Fear of burning, fear of growls, damaged by combat finishes. Summoner, call him by animized, bolt breaker, battle hardened. Huh. Okay. Well thanks for that. Oh, come on, get off of that. Thank you. No problem. Name of power. We gotta free some people again. Because they always seem to get tied to sticks rather than well, anything else. Oh god, don't get them spotted now. Sneaking about. Hey, you! We're tied up here. Please help. Oh. Helping, come on. Whoa, I don't know what happened to the camera. There. Up ahead. They're close to death. Oh, the Dark Lord is inside every field. You insult him, you insult all of them. Did I just hear something? Got him! Don't let him stay! Let's go! Get rid of that guy. Get out of here. I don't have time to feel. feel, feel. I don't have time to I mess around dead. with small fry. There we go. Thank goodness you're free. Help me. Where's that Dark Lord now? Rotten creatures deserve everything you give them. Thank you, Lord. There we go. Right, we got that. I don't want to do that. Uh, it's got this over here, but I want to go get this. It's in the middle of like a dock or something, I think that is. And it's this way. I want to carry barrels here. Then they make us 
sure I'm on Fell douche. I ain't never been more ready to face the Somewhere up there. Some tower. I don't know, because I see it. Well, let's go grab it, shall we? Nor Edward. Legendary Graug. The nation's still of a growl, towering all over as a 30 foot monstrosity. Covered in mortars, as if it were war chiefs. Too bad I already killed it. Ooh, green. Half the most most future drug. Old rock. Sawbones. As the elves or orcs, these orcs are imbued with basic knowledge of herb lore and anatomy, allowing them to perform rudimentary medical treatment, which generally involves some form of amputation. All right then. For hacking meat, they often moonlight as cooks and brew the putrid and flammable orc rock that keeps the orc army on its feet. Grog attacks. Grog hunter. Grog bleed. Herbs. Got some herbs. Right, so there's one here. Last time, get out of my way. Tell me about this guy, Kothuk the Catcher. Damage to from machine and damage by explosion. Adam. They beat up their own captors. Climb up. Ah, no, not dead, Vramas. Uh, there's a collectible over there. I want to go get. I want to get all the collectibles before I do the mission. Or any mission. Into the hole. Turn and fishery. Ooh, a kraken. The watcher will rising up in anger, churn the waters with massive tentacles and lash out at the razor toothed mouth of those who would defile the sea of Nernan. The fishery has been destroyed before. That treasure chest. Oh no, it's just that man built has turned so many Ulrich against us. It's been hard to know who to fight. 
Weathered Azurite figurine, the two Istari. The crudely carved figurine depicts two enigmatic wizards who came to Mordor hunting a great evil. Although the pair likely never escaped the cursed realm, their exploits were well detailed and may have inspired the creation of magical cults throughout Middle Earth. See, there were two of them, and they both came in from the road with a hard look in their eyes, as if they traveled too far and seen too much. They were wizards, true, both of them caked in dust. And when one had talk, he'd stop to think, and there'd be the other to finish right up. Like they had one brain and two mouths. It was creepy for sure, but neither seemed to notice. I heard them say they were hunting the darkness. Damned if I know if they found it. But I guess those fellows can find trouble when they're looking for it. Probably wouldn't even need to look, they'd probably just find it. Oh, the darkness is right here. Let's put it over there. I laughed at Deer Hyle when he talked of wizards, necromancers, and magic. I told him to stop being a child. As children, you are closest to the Eldar. When grown, you have no understanding of immortality. That makes no fucking sense. I thought I had. That's right, you better run. As I brand you, Mr. No Face. You're dead! I thought I heard something in there. Collectible! Orcish dagger. Dagger may be a generous application of the word. This crude shank, and it will. This is a crude shank, and it will never be used for anything but skull doggery. Your orc generally carry blades of this ilk when engaged in their misdeeds, and the blades are often coated with crude poisons to ensure a victim's painful death. Orcs will often carry daggers like this one into combat, but only employ them as a last resort. You've been recalled. Aye, it was Gilead. They're burning the bodies there. It's that bad. It's worse. We've abandoned Duathan. Either to the orcs or the outcasts. I can't imagine which is worse. The orcs. We're thin on the ground here. Two regiments worth called back home. Maybe a dozen more down with the sweats. Maybe even more than that. And I don't think we can hide it anymore. No matter how they change up the patrols. The orcs may have already smelted out too. They're getting uppity in Mordor. Here, look at this. That's quite a blade. Where'd you get it? Off an orc scout. I expect he won't need it anymore. You keep it. Well, he didn't, seeing as I just found it. Alright, next one is... Yeah, I can get this on the way back. The, uh... Glowy word thing. <laughs> that is the spirit of Mordor. The knife in the back. They do our work for us. They are united in their hatred of man, and dominated by the will of their master. Oh, whoa, wait, wait, no, that's a, that's a, Orc Lord, Orc Lord? You know what I mean. That's a cool shot. Someone's sneaking at the There he is. P. Goog. Thunderhead. Malmoog. Malmoog. Or. Oh. Skark. 
Stop the sneak, eh? The pleasant smell of pipeweed emanates from the oversized pouch. The owner of this pouch harvested both the leaves and the flowers of the pipeweed plant in equal measure. The leaves are commonly dried and smoked in pipes, and the flowers chew to create a potent narcotic. As for the pouch itself, it appears to have been come from a poison sack of an ongo. Careful with the pouch, Jonathan. It almost went in the fire. Wow, that old thing. Time to get rid of that rag. It barely keeps the pipeweed dry. It is a rag, brother. And I'll keep this souvenir from our first hunt till it turns to dust. Remember us tracking that great spider through Mirkwood nearly 60 years ago? Then drawing her out using live bait. Yes, but why do I always have to be the bait? You have a quality. You make things want to kill you. It's a gift, really. But Torvin, this was your first kill. Ours together is what made you a hunter. And I'll treasure it always, brother. Oh. I'll mark the other one on the map before I forget. I caught deer hire puffing on that pipeweed once. He raided the garrison pantry and consumed a week's worth of field rations. Human minds and appetites are a mystery to my people. And away we go. It's nice knowing you. I think. Right, we'll see if we can get... I don't know, so I'm just going to do it just to see what happens. Hey! You're bold, I'll give you that! And so much more! Will you? I mean, you don't really seem that much of a threat. Okay, stop it. You'll pay for this! I'll kill you next time, you filth! Alright, I need to get rid of these guys. Mine. Okay. I'm gonna command you. I'm gonna command you to become this guy's bodyguard. Still down here. Skark. Hey, what's up? You gave my lads a good laugh running away like that. Let's see how much more fun we can have. Well, I can't run this time, seeing as you're back in the corner now. Tell me about this new guy. Takra the Black Gate. Okay. Rise that beacon! Right, let's go get this uh, relic. I think this is the last one. Uh oh, here 
Here we go. Frowning Skull. For a thousand years, this skull has been a sacred relic of the most fierce, feared orc assassin's cult within Mordor, the Death's Head. They hold it as a symbol of their glorious future free of the Scourge of Man. So why is it frowning? And why is it here if it's a sacred relic? Please, my wife! Yes, the Uruk have told me you to go on about her. Tell us what we need to know. Where are the bandits? Where are your friends? I need to see her. I need... Yes, your wife. Again. It has been a long time. And while the physical pain of your torture will pass, you will always hurt inside. The loss is like a gaping wound. You have suffered quite enough torment. And it is time for your misery to end. Your wife is waiting. Damn you. They're in the woods. The hidden woods. Take them away. What you said? Yes, our promise. You will be reunited with your wife. Now long dead. No, you have betrayed your friends and doomed yourself over a distant memory, a phantom. And when you are reunited with your wife, know that we will also carry your skull as a trifle and a reminder that our will is irresistible. Now go, your wife awaits. Well then. Is that all of them? It looks like it is. There's no empties, so... That's all the collectibles. All the artifacts, anyway. Now we got is this thing. There are stories and fates more bitter than ours within Mordor. Those who gave in to despair, who abandoned all hope of redemption. That is not our fate. Is it? Is it not? We'll see about that. <laughs> An Adli had something. Okay, what am I missing? Oh, the Lord of Light. I am the bright Lord of Mordor, the silver hand that drives back the darkness, reaching to the Frog of Night to avenge those long betrayed arise from the fields of death and march forth from the shadow. Through the purifying flames of war, you who were once Eldar shall be reforged. Beneath my hammer, the bringer of gifts, the betrayer shall be unmade. I renounce the blessed realm to redeem the land of shadow, and bind the walls of ardor in place of the Dark Lord. You shall have light undiminished, all shall fear me and rejoice. Nani hir gelar mordor. Ivab gelebren yachortha ivorn. Tridaol Heath Efuen An Achared Di Werienin Anan Erio Thelaith Gurth Edwenno Ogwath Trilaith Puigadol Dagol Nathadir Edwagenin Inaudir Edil Nunamnin Nathatognir Inain Iwath Dangarnen Ochedin Valanor, an Ablethad Nor Eduath, a Noded Ramas Senardon, Michan de Morhir, Nathalekalad Arfigad, Nin Gostatha Gwaithban Agelatha. Okay then. I don't know if I've done it all because there's a there's a gap missing, but it doesn't seem like I'm missing anything, so maybe it's an extra mission. Um, nothing's come up on the map, but I don't see any more, um, things. So, I guess I'll do one of these. I'll do the bow one, I guess. Though my power is diminished, it is not wholly spent. 
We will not abandon Middle-earth and depart into the West until the Betrayer and all his works are undone. Well, I don't think that. Okay, then. Blake, drop your guard for a second. The Grey Walker will catch you. A carrot. Jump. That filthy tuck! Give me the bow one. A single arrow, rightly placed, can turn the tide of war. He unleashed death in the enemy camp while ever setting setting foot inside. Fetting set fetting suit. <laughs> Use five caragols to kill him. Is that done then? <laughs> and this one is the servants of the Dark Lord knew he was coming. They planned and repaired, prepared. They encased themselves in armor and bore heavy shields. They believed they were ready for him. They were not. What are we to do? Kill defenders without raising the alarm. Kill Uruk from strike from above. A hunter who's good at hurling spears. Tarkla. We should have extra warriors guarding our throne, not to stop you, but to stop the stinking tar from blowing it up. I missed one of the people back here. Which I guess is a good idea because now I can do stuff from above. Dead. 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 Dead.
Nice. All right, and I think with that we'll end it here for today. So I'll just fire one of my skills, and then we'll stop. Death threat, uh, fire arrow, shadow mount. Instantly mounts a Karago or Growl with a shadow strike. Definitely yes. I think with that. We're going to end it here, so thanks a lot for joining, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Next time we'll be doing probably that mine mission that's nearby. So until then, this is Major Shepard, hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one guys. Until then, bye!